Okay, today we're going to study about, uh, continue to study about the insect, but uh, the body, the insect body plant. So you go to page 329, you see a very important insect, that's bees. So you see here the anatomy of a bees. You see here the stinger, the rectum, intestine. Uh, you see here the heart. You see the heart is, is not on, on the head or in the middle, but it is it's not on the thorax, but it's there on the abdomen, okay? And then we see uh, the stomach and the crop. And uh, this is a part of uh, uh, the anatomy of a bee on page 329. And then one more important thing on the bee, many other important things, is the eyes. They have simple eyes and they have compound eyes. So the compound eyes is dividing thousands of a little tiny parts that they can see everywhere. And they have a simple eyes on the top that they can see too. Not much, but they can. So in such a way that they use all these eyes that they can see this side, in front, and all the top. So uh, this is uh, very interesting. And then you see that the spiracles is where they have the process of respiration. It's on the abdomen, so the spiracles, on the insect. Now, uh, when we talk about the insect, we go to page 330, you're going to see there the antenna. Why is it they put a, 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 a lot of paragraph about antenna? Because the antenna of the insect is very important. What the antenna is used for? They use for taste, smell, and hear. So they have the antenna. If you cut the antenna, they cannot taste the food, they cannot smell, they cannot hear. So it's going to be very hard to survive. And you have all different kinds of antenna. You see the locust, you see the cockroach, uh, golden rod, American roofing fly. And then you see here the June beetle, and then you see carrion beetle, potato beetle. You see all these different kinds of what? Antenna. They all I use with this, uh, you know, I use it for taste and what? Smell and hear. Now, and then on page 3 to the 31, you see all different kinds of what? The shapes. Of, uh, of a mouse. You see here we have around one, two, and three, and four different kinds. You have sucking, you have uh, a churning, and, uh, and the others that I'm not going to talk to take too much time. But when you get to page 332, you have different kinds of legs. For jumping legs, Parallax, digging legs, and swimming legs, and poly carrying legs. You see, God designed all these insects with some uh, function in the ecosystem. All are important in the ecosystem, and they were designed for the, some different job, different function in, in, in the nature. So it is very important that you take a look on that and then the homework will be 9.2. So thank you and God bless you.